when I did Life Stories with you, we talked about this at length and I could see how moved you were. What do you feel 20 mm. years on about Don Blaine and what happened? And Amy in particular, this extraordinary Amy interview. Amy is incredible. She's so, so brave and she spoke so eloquently. Um, and I think it just brings it all back to, to, to everyone. I can't believe it's 20 years. And my thoughts obviously are with everyone who has been affected by this. And, you know, Piers, it's the worst thing that I've ever had to cover. It was absolutely horrific and it happens time and time again you see it happening in america and you just think when are they going to come to their senses how many children have to die before they actually change the law it doesn't make any sense listening to amy amy put it better than i ever could or any or any politician ever could because she lived through it that that's what happened to her as a tiny five-year-old child um, and i don't understand why anybody listening to what she had to say i don't understand why they could ever have a, an argument for not having gun control it doesn't make any well, sense to Lorraine, me at all Lorraine and I we, we know we have a mutual uh, friend Pam yep. Ross who lost her daughter mm. Joanna who, if she's watching she's a wonderful lady like so many of those poor parents you know who we just remember and then they have to get on with their lives and they're such brave people mm.